And did you guys see the breaking news that just dropped by Adrian Wojnarowski? Carmelo Anthony's alleged video. daughter turned his alleged daughter turned five. Okay, so <laughs> that's so okay. Yeah, so I was right about that. She's a whore. He's never publicly claimed the child. He's never publicly claimed there was, her. There yeah, was he's some never rumor her. about Melo and like the reason Melo isn't on a LeBron team anymore is because they had a falling out or something. I believe uh, it. I don't know if there was any validity to that, but I believe it. He doesn't even talk about Melo anymore, LeBron. No, it's not like he talks like it's not like he doesn't really hang with like Chris Paul and Wade and them anymore. The Banana Boat Crew, they kind of forced yeah. him out. Who? LeBron got forced out. Melo. Bro, LeBron still fucks with Wade all the time. I just don't I really see them talking to Melo anymore. Dude, they I low key think Wade, and LeBron, and all of them, they just they they they're swingers with each other. <laughs> no, I mean, uh, that's how oh, it is in golf. Man. Is it? Uh, yeah, I know Dustin Johnson's Dustin fucking Johnson, big. Man. Yeah, he's, Brooks, he's, I think they Dustin were, Johnson's big about yeah, that they're shit. Doing cocaine, yeah, they're doing uh, cocaine and shit. Apparently, that's like, that's like true. What? Apparently, it's just true. Dustin what? Johnson and Brooks okay. Kepka swapped wives or something, and like on a coke vendor in like 2012 or uh, there was <laughs> that something. Definitely made, that definitely sounds true. I mean, it's Dustin Johnson. He was doing all kinds of drugs at that time. Yeah, that's pretty incredible. If it is true. I will say. Okay, so we got ourselves right here. Bucks coaching. Uh, the Bucks are narrowing down a group of top candidates, according to Adrian Wojnarowski, in their head coaching search. Those candidates are Nick Nurse, Golden State's Kenny Atkinson, former Char Charlotte Hornets and Brooklyn Nets coach. <laughs> no one got okay. Okay, that's just me laughing. Toronto assistant Adrian Griffin and these coaches will be part of the final conversation with the Milwaukee leadership this week. That means we'll probably hear a decision between Thursday and Sunday. Nurse still looms prominently in the Phoenix Suns at Philadelphia. Some of the searches. So initial reactions, what is it and who do you want to be the coach? Nick Nurse. That, that's ideal. I think that's who they want, but... Uh... I don't know what what job would you say is the best job of all of these three for Nick Nurse to take? Boston. No, no, no. Uh, these three of these three. <laughs> not Boston. We're not there yet. Joe Mazzulla hasn't been fired yet. Of these three, we'll talk about that later in the show. We'll talk about that right? later. That's coming in the show. Who would you? What would you say is the best job of these three for Nick Nurse? Called that. You called that. You were the one who first speculated that the own Celtics in the first round thought he might be fired. But <laughs> um, obviously, Nick Nurse, I think, is best team, Milwaukee, because it's already built and it's very little needs to be done to fix it. Second, the Suns. And then I just, the, I think the Sixers are a shit show. Oh, yeah. There's more going on. Like, in terms of like on court talent, it's great, but you don't know what's going on there. Yeah, but and even. Like the I talent think the there is like the Raptors. I think like the Raptors already had a good team built. They just needed somebody to come in and take them over the top, and that's what Nick Nurse did with with Dwayne Casey's team in Toronto. And this is like more of the same. No, I like I like the Milwaukee fit the best. Yeah, I just think right here when you look at the situation, it's just it makes more sense for Nick Nurse to want to go to Milwaukee 